I have the honor of introducing the next graduate. She is a hardworking, personable, relationship-based student who has the ability to succeed in life through using a lot of the skills she learned at Edison. During her four years, we've had the opportunity to connect and support each other through the journey. And it's so nice to have students for four years and you can really see them grow. And she has grown so much and I'm so, so proud of her. And I know she's gonna do whatever she wants to do in life. And I'm really gonna miss you. Ladies and gentlemen, Peyton Raleigh. When I look at what Edison has done for me, there is so much to be thankful for. I'll start off with the teachers and staff. Not only are they my teachers, but they are people I look up to and people I will stay connected to my whole life. Not only has Edison brought me hope and the tools to be able to succeed in the world, but it has gifted me with the most amazing friends I could ever ask for. With Lily and our Dutch runs and our crazy car dance parties, Catherine and our awesome farm adventures, Kel and Shay and I sneaking out of class to go bug Miss Lucas. Thanks, Lou, for putting up with us. To Rachel and Natalie in our Starbucks runs during lunch. Now for some thank yous. Thanks to Miss Lucas for being an awesome friend and a huge role model, as well as kicking the boys out on Wednesday so we can have a girls only lunch. Thanks, John, for always getting in trouble in sign language for talking when it was 100% both of us. You're just louder than me. Thanks, John, for also taking the blame during English when it was 100% me and Kellen. Thanks to all the counselors for supporting me during my high school time. And Mr. Wold for eating lunch with me every day as we had competitions to see who had the best dad jokes. You won, obviously. I'd also like to thank my whole family, but especially my parents for finding a school and fighting almost my whole life so that I could be taught in a way I would learn. Thank you.